hell? Okay, no joke, where is everybody? That is so off the chart. Did you see your friend's newspaper strip? It's got a black dude and a lesbian teaming up to save the world. Oh my God, she did it. Pretty gutsy. Not really, just the right thing to do. Hey, I thought you were having a dress rehearsal. So did I, but last night after our run through, a bunch of people went out and got stupid food poisoning. This is a disaster, I'm freaking. What can I do? Can you play five different roles and run the lights? No. But I know some people who can. Okay. You guys. So I'm on lights. What do I do? Just meet me on stage. I'll be there in a minute. Hey, baby. Can you get yourself from the station to the school? We've got a situation. Hey, so you want to run lines again? I, I don't mind. What would I do without you? No chance you'll ever have to know. You better stop making yourself so important to me. <laughs> Why is it such a bad thing? Just not part of the plan. Hey, is this cue supposed to be a blackout or a fade? Oh, shit, a gel just caught on fire. <sighs> And I ask, where did she come from? Friend of your beloved. She is truly fine. But it doesn't change my resolve. Maybe this will. Vivian loves her some girls. One more thing we have in common. I like her even better. I'm not giving up. We're like a couple of days away and I don't have my cues down, my costume isn't ready, and we were supposed to change the blocking. I mean, how do you not have rehearsal two days before the opening? It'll be okay, we're all gonna help. I need to take it down a notch. You're the only person I've told about this, Sophie. Please swear you won't let this get out. I wouldn't, ever. Don't worry. This is what you wanted, right? Oh, great. Thanks, Arch. Was I being a diva to him or something? God, I know I'm being hyper. It's probably the Prozac. The doctor changed my dose and every little thing is throwing me off. I thought antidepressants were supposed to make a person chill. <sighs> Maybe I'm just hopeless. Baby, this is killer. You think? You are so damn cute. <laughs> I mean, the character. Who needs a name, by the way? You can't call her <laughs> a lesbian reporter chick. Next <laughs> week, she gets a girlfriend. No way. Who also doesn't have a name. <laughs> You're really doing this? Well, Archibald hasn't gotten her luscious lips right yet because I'm very strict when it comes to my girlfriend's the lesbian reporter's girlfriend's lips. <laughs> Seriously, going to have to take you somewhere right now and do things to you. <laughs> hey, did you get a picture of Dr. Glass's baby? Oh my God. <laughs> Charlie is the awesomest baby ever. Are we gonna have one of those someday? Hey! <sighs> 
Elizabeth wants to know if you can stand in for her in the scene so we can focus the lights. She's having a meltdown. <laughs> Do you need help with anything else? You are officially my new best friend. What exactly are we doing? Not a clue. Dave, <laughs> how do you feel about playing Trigorn? I think I can channel the man in me. So, if, can you read my part, Nina, so I can see what it looks like? What's the play about, anyway? A young girl in love with an older man and a teenage boy who kills himself over it. <laughs> Anytime you're ready. Um, tomorrow I'll be gone from here. I'm leaving everything. I'm starting a new life. I'm going to Moscow too, like you. We'll see each other there. You're so beautiful. It makes me so happy knowing that I can look into those wonderful eyes, that inexpressibly sweet smile, this lovely face. Aren't you gonna kiss her? Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> it's in the script. Yeah, didn't you share that willow underwear or something? What's little making out? That wasn't cool, dude. No, really, we need the kiss to adjust the light. Okay, at least just move a little bit closer. Take the last line again, please. Uh, that inexplicably uh, sweet smile, this lovely face, uh, like an angel's. Sophie, that's your cue. <laughs> Need someone to show you how it's done? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Don't be upset. I made him do it. Yeah, right. Nice. But baby, come on, it wasn't real. Then why do I feel sick? Esther, don't go! Are you going? Arch, what's this about? Did I do something wrong? I thought I was getting to know you, but now I'm not sure that would be a good thing for either of us. Sorry. Not your fault. It had to happen. She'd be crazy to give you up for Sophie. I thought you were into her. She's cool, but... I don't waste my time on straight girls. I like that. I like not wasting time. <laughs> 